Woman is a violent and uncontrolled animal, and it is useless to let go the reins and then expect her not to kick over the traces. You must keep her on a tight rein. Women want total freedom or rather, to call things by their names, total license. If you allow them to achieve complete equality with men, do you think they will be easier to live with? Not at all. Once they have achieved equality, they will be your masters. If you are ruled by mind you are a king, if by body, a slave. Those who are serious in ridiculous matters will be ridiculous in serious matters. I prefer to do right and get no thanks than to do wrong and receive no punishment. We cannot control the evil tongues of others, but a good life enables us to disregard them. The hero saves us. Praise the hero. Now, who will save us from the hero? Wise men profit more from fools than fools from wise men. For the wise men shun the mistakes of fools, but fools do not imitate the successes of the wise. The worst ruler is one who cannot rule himself. After I'm dead I'd rather have people ask why I have no monument than why I have one. Furthermore, I think Carthage must be destroyed. Suffer women once to arrive at an equality with you, and they will from that moment become your superiors. Tis sometimes the height of wisdom to feign stupidity. I think the first virtue is to restrain the tongue. He approaches nearest to gods who knows how to be silent, even though he is in the right. He who fears death has already lost the life he covets. An angry man opens his mouth and shuts his eyes. Anger so clouds the mind that it cannot perceive the truth. I can pardon everybody's mistakes except my own. All mankind rules its women, and we rule all mankind, but our women rule us. It is a difficult matter to argue with the belly since it has no ears. Speech is the gift of all, but the thought of few. Patience is the greatest of all virtues. Grasp the subject, the words will follow. He is nearest to the gods who knows how to be silent. Wise men learn more from fools than fools from the wise. Buy not what you want, but what you have need of. What you do not want is dear at a farthing. The public has more interest in the punishment of an injury than he who receives it. Farming. If you do one thing late, you will be late in all your work. Even though work stops, expenses run on. Lighter as the wound foreseen. When you have decided to purchase a farm, be careful not to buy rashly. Do not spare your visits and be not content with a single tour of inspection. The more you go, the more will the place please you, if it be worth your attention.
give heed to the appearance of the neighborhood. A flourishing country should show its prosperity. When you go in, look about, so that, when needs be, you can find your way out. There is a wide difference between true courage and a mere contempt of life. Between the mouth and the morsel many things may happen. When you have arrived at your country house and have saluted your household, you should make the rounds of the farm the same day, if possible. If not, then certainly the next day. When you have observed how the field work has progressed, what things have been done, and what remains undone, you should summon your overseer the next day, and should call for a report of what work has been done in good season and why it has not been possible to complete the rest, and what wine and corn and other crops have been gathered.